YouTubers, Mommy Ray Ray, how's everybody today? Today I am coming to you with my tofu stir fry, guys. I used to cook all the time for one of my patients that I had in the past, and this is how she like it, guys. So I'm gonna put it my way and her way, and I hope you guys enjoy this video today. Today I am going to make for you this nice tofu stir fry. I have firm tofu here, guys. I have about six cloves of garlic. I have a table teaspoon, excuse me, of sugar. I have a little ginger. Ginger. I have green um, onions. I have my tofu, mayonnaise, five spices, white pepper, and a little bit of minced onions and a little salt. I have my bean sprouts. I have olive oil in here, guys. I really wish that I had my coconut oil, but I don't, unfortunately. I have my raspberry basmati vinegar. I have soy sauce and Worcestershire sauce and A1. I noticed on a lot of my comments, guys, that a lot of people ask me about the A1. Here in the United States, guys, A1 is a steak sauce, okay? So I have my mushrooms, my onions, green peppers, and garlic here guys so what i want you to know is tofu does not have a taste to it guys it's whatever you make of it whatever you want your tofu to taste like that's what it tastes like all right guys let's get this show on the road all right here so you see i have my tofu and what i did guys i wanted to pat it dry because that's the way it works out the best and i'm going to show you now that i've got it dry guys how I'm going to cut this up. I'm going to go in about this thick. You see that? I'm going in and I'm cutting it. So I'm cutting it down in some slices, guys, as though it was a cake. Just imagine cutting a cake. And then I'm going to take it and I'm going to cut it that way. I'm going to go in. Okay, I went in and then I'm going to go down again so that I will have bite-sized pieces because that's the way we want our tofu. And then we're gonna fry it. Okay guys, so I got my tofu all cut up. And like I said, I have the firm tofu. I'm putting it in my bowl, guys. So let's do this, guys. Let's cook it. I'll be right back. Yeah. All right guys, I'm back. Now let's go in with our stir fry tofu. We cut it up, right? So you just want to just take it into that hot grease. And you want to fry it up. So we got it in there, guys. And we don't want to bother this. We want to let it cook for about three to five minutes, depending on. I got it on a medium high heat. This has to cook. And then we're going to go in with our love, guys. As soon as this we get this together here, where it cooks for like three to five minutes, I am going to start flipping it over. I'm only doing this so that it don't stick. Sometimes your tofu stick together and you don't want that. You want your bite-sized pieces to have love in there, deliciousness in there, guys. So this is going to cook for three to five minutes. You have to keep checking it, guys. You don't want to walk away from your stove. This is going to be a meal to die for, guys. And I'll be right back. All right, guys. While our tofu is in there cooking, I'm going to go in with a tablespoon of mayonnaise. The mayonnaise of your choice. It does not matter. Okay? And then I'm going to take this... Um, Five spices, guys. I'm putting five spices in there. This is really a taste that you want to get that you like. Okay, and I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of five spice. And I'm going to go in with a little Worcestershire sauce. And then I'm going to go in with a little A1, which is that steak sauce. Because I some people will use oyster sauce. I'm going to put a little soy sauce in here. I'm going to put a little bit of raspberry basmati vinegar. And I'm going to put in my black pepper. I'm going to sprinkle just a little salt in here for taste. 
And last but not least, a little bit of minced garlic. All right, guys, I have to get a little teaspoon of sugar to also go in here because this is our base. So I'll be right back, guys. Hold on until I get that sugar. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm realizing, guys, that I don't have enough for my sauce. So I'm going back in for another heaping tablespoon. So that makes me have two of them now instead of just one. Because that's not enough, guys. You want to have enough for your sauce. So I'm going to repeat my steps over again of everything that I used the first time. I'm going to put it back in here because I did go in and get some more. And I'm going to put everything back in here that I had the first time. Okay? This is a really great stir fry. You guys are really going to enjoy this stir fry, guys. And I want you to try it and tell me what did you think of it. Okay? So I got all of this back in here. I'm just going to put another dash of that salt in there. Okay? And I'm going back to whip it again. See that? Because this is going to go over all of our love in there that's cooking. And here is my sugar. You don't want to leave that out. Just mix it up in there, guys. You can cook this over heat if you like, but I'm not going to do it, guys. But that's what your sauce should look like. Look at that. Okay? And I'll be right back. All right, guys, I've been turning it over because I wanted to kind of crisp up for our stir fry. And the good thing about it is once it's cooked that five minutes on that side and you start flipping it over, it does not take as long for the other way. So what we're going to do for the other side, guys, it won't take long at all. I'm going to bring this actually out. And as you can see, look at that golden brown on there. But you do want all of this oil up out of here. You want it out of your tofu. So I'm going to take this out and put it in here to drain. Okay. Okay, and I'm taking it out. And you see how pretty that is, guys? Beautiful. Okay, I'm going to take this out, guys, and I'm going to take all of this oil up out of my skillet because I don't want all of that on my vegetables, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. Now I'm going to go in with that garlic, and I need all of it. Uh, then I got this ginger. And now I'm going to go in with my onions, mushrooms, green peppers, red peppers, guys. All of that's going in there. All of your love is right here. And if you notice, guys, I did not add any more oil. I took what I had out. The little bit that was left in there was enough. If you feel you want butter, more um oiled in there, your vegetable oil, coconut oil, whatever you desire. That's why they call them recipes because you can make your recipe. Okay guys, you see that? I'm just going to give this a little love, put a little seasoning to my vegetables. See how beautiful this is, guys? This is going to sweat up. Beautiful, huh? All right. Now I'm going to go in with that sauce that we made with the mayonnaise. And all of our love is going in here. I hope you guys are enjoying this video with me today. I really hope you guys are enjoying this. Okay. Oh, if you guys could just smell it. 
smells awesome. We're going to let all of that steam up in our love, guys. The love stir fry today. You see that creaminess all over. See how far that went? Two tablespoons of your favorite mayonnaise. It's summertime and you want to eat a little lighter, guys, so it's nothing wrong with that. You don't always have to have a piece of meat every day. Okay, now that we got all that together, I'm going to go in with my bean sprouts. You can make you a, some rice, some noodles, whichever you prefer, guys. But this is going to be delicious. I am going to sprinkle just a little bit of salt, guys, on this. See my pink salt? Alrighty. Okay, we're going to let this steam up for about four or five minutes, guys. But keep checking it to your desire. I just want it just to soften up a little bit, but I hate mushy vegetables. So I'm going to just let it just steam up a little bit, guys, with this lid on here. And I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. Do you see that? Juicy, nice vegetables. Now we're going to go in with your tofu. Now what do you think about that? I'm going to give it a few little flips over. There you go. And if you just got to have the meat guys that day, get a piece of turkey or chicken breast and grill it. That cooks for maybe two minutes and you're done guys. That's how easy it is for Mommy Ray Ray's stir fry tofu this is a meal to die for and this is what it is i'm going to plate it up guys let you see it and like i said if you want noodles white rice brown rice whatever your desired rice is spanish rice whatever you guys want put it in there i'm going to plate this up and i'll be right back Nobody's not going to dislike this. No one. That's when you want to take this. Put this all around it, guys. Make it, your onions on there. Put your little parsley on there. Hold it for me. Thank you. You got it? Okay. Alright guys, you see that? Is. Mommy Ray Ray's stir fried vegetables. Alright guys, if you like this recipe, please give me a thumbs up, a comment, and subscribe to me guys. This is very easy to make. I hope it'll be easy for you. Voila! Have a great day guys. See you soon. Bye bye!